Welcome back to our channel, guys. Hey. <laughs> so we just got finished doing the second coat of the drywall primer. Yay. <laughs> it didn't take too, too long since the first coat was already there. It was basically just filling in all the spots where you can see the blue still. Mm -hmm. And, you know, just working on the drywall that way. And it came out really, really good. It did. It was, it's phenomenal. <laughs> and now all we really have left to do is we got some trim work to do. We have paint to do. Mm -hmm. We are ready to get on it today, guys. So I say, let's get it. Yes. Now that that second coat of drywall primer is finished, the walls are ready to be painted. Yeah. <laughs> Once that's done, I'm ready to put on some trim in the living room. I gotta still do the window trim, the floor trim. I haven't done any of that stuff yet yeah. because we've been waiting, yeah. you know. But one thing I wanted to show you guys, which you guys might not have seen yet, and it's really cool. My sister and my brother-in-law, Melanie and Gary from Simple Life Reclaimed, they just got something on the property they've been waiting to get for a long time. Yeah. Wow. Hose is frozen. <laughs> ours, is, ours is frozen too. Yeah. Let's see if uh, water are right here. Mm -hmm. Check it out, guys. Oh. Melanie and Gary got some chickens. Finally, it's about time, huh? <laughs> are they all scared and hiding? Well, the dogs are circling them like sharks. Mm. We come over here and then the dogs are like, hey, I want some, and the chickens go under there and hide. Yeah, no. Check it out, guys. Aren't they cool? Yeah, so they got a chicken coop going. Yeah. Which is really cool. Finally, it's about time. I've missed having chickens, man. We used to have chickens in Arizona, and it's been a long time coming. Yeah. How many did you guys get for now? Um, we got 11 hens and one rooster just to start. Um, the Avatuvan company, they sent us this chicken coop just to, to try it and stuff, and it's nice. I really like it. Yeah, it's cool. We're definitely going to be expanding, though. There, this is uh, not going to be big enough for our needs in the future, but it's a great way for us to get started for right now. Yeah. And with eggs being so expensive, I mean, <laughs> we want to start. Yeah, don't let me, uh, don't catch me lying on those eggs being so expensive. <laughs> we heard they were like $9 for an 18 pack in where? Uh, well, in Vegas. In <laughs> Vegas, yeah. which is insane. That, that is insane. Oh, I see. Yeah. What's going on, guys? Chicky chickies. All right. They're all it's all right. You look familiar, chicken. You look like your bobblehead chicken. It is. It's a groovy <laughs> egg chicken. It's a groovy egg. Gonna give us some groovy eggs. You know what's funny about chickens? Mm. Watch, watch its head. Oh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Where is our rooster? You look like a Miss Gray. Yeah. You look Ms. like Gray. a Miss Gray. Betty. Yeah. Well, that looks like uh, speckles right there. Yeah. He's right there. I'm trying to get a comb or anything like that. He's... So that's the rooster right here. Yeah, he's the man. Yep. He's ready. When he gets bigger, uh, Jeff said that he's gonna get a lot of really pretty colors, and oh, yeah. he's gonna get a really pretty neck. And mm -hmm. come on, Luna. This kind of brings back a little bit of memories <laughs> from earlier this year. Yeah. <laughs> like, hmm, which one's the rooster? I think it's this one. I think. It's I think it's that one. I'm yeah. not sure yet. We have one that looks a lot like this one right here. Don't worry guys, don't worry. 
Yeah. Yeah, you're definitely a hen. You are. You could be a rooster. I'm not sure though. See, so now they have chickens like we do. Oh, right. yes. So I'm pretty sure none of us are gonna run out of eggs coming up pretty soon. Yeah, yeah. thank God. We're gonna have tons <laughs> of eggs because this last go around, we were getting like 12 to 15 a day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. And you guys yeah. were sharing, you guys oh, were yeah. sharing. Oh yeah, we gave them a bunch. So yeah. they didn't run out of eggs this last go around either, but definitely not now. Yeah, no. and, and more the merrier, especially when they start puckering up in the winter, you know, we'll have, we'll have leftovers. So. Mm hmm All right, well, we gotta get back to work, guys. Yeah, All us right. too. Thanks for showing us the coop, <laughs> appreciate no it. <laughs> Well, we have to go get the paint. <laughs> Roxanne's been waiting and waiting and deciding and deciding on what paint she wants to use inside the living room and the kitchen. And I think you've decided. I think so too, yeah. Yep, so we've been waiting for that <laughs> to go get the paint. Yay! So it's time to go, guys. Let's get it. Yep, we got our paint. Roxanne's got her colors all picked out. We got them here. Yep. Right? And it's gonna be a good day, guys. It is. So far, it's been a great day. Fresh new hay for you guys. about time ladies <laughs> two eggs <laughs> all right good size eggs too mm -hmm. all right. sweet i'm happy i am happy happy we haven't had any eggs in like a week and i was just telling them how good they were they're laying eggs when it was cold and everything and then they go ahead and not lay an egg for a week <laughs> so sweet all right so the guy with that we ordered our wood from, he gave us such a good deal. Yeah, we I would say we scored. <laughs> I, had, I had to share this with you guys. Yeah. I was thinking about it on the way home and I was like, man, I'm not gonna get into it too much because it's a local area, but he basically saved us over a thousand dollars by making a phone call. Yeah. So I'm very happy, and if you see this, you know who you are. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so 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 much. We ordered like three different things for the price of what we thought one thing was gonna be. Yeah, and actually, we kind of changed our plans a little bit and went and got a different type of mm -hmm. material, so. Yep, different wood, um, it, it's just awesome. Yeah, so, yeah. Wanted, to re wanted to reiterate that, you guys, that we have such a good community out here, they hook us up sometimes, um, so thank you very much. We really appreciate it, it saved us a lot of money. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> Could it be to make the ground Shine like cold until winter comes. Until winter comes. Until winter comes. It really makes me wonder.
right guys, well it's the next day. We let the drywall primer dry <laughs> for a full 24 hours to really make sure that it, it was completely dry mm -hmm. um, before we started painting. Yeah, and looks really good. You know, yeah. we wanted to make sure that was done. So that's done and the walls are ready. Yes. They are ready to go. So I'm really excited about seeing all the colors Roxanne picked out. Yeah, me too. It's not a lot of colors, but the colors, <laughs> Yeah, right? yeah. And I'm really looking forward to uh, later on this week once our order comes in and we can start working on that stuff. Ooh, and yes. Really, good. really excited about it, guys. Yeah, no, it's an exciting week. It is. It is. <laughs> I'm ready to get it, so yeah. let's get busy. Yeah. Here it is, the paint. Uh, when we were in town yesterday, we stopped by Ace and picked out our paint, which I'm going to be painting the house pretty much, I don't know how well you can see, but pretty much the same color that we've been using like in our bedroom and Thunderdome and the laundry room. But I do plan on painting an accent wall. And I think between this color and the color I chose for the accent wall, it's gonna look phenomenal in there. So excited to get this started, guys. All right. I'm gonna add some color. Ready to get some painting going on in the house, rather than just drywall. <laughs> Sick of drywall. <laughs> it's gonna look good, baby. I know, I'm excited. Look at that. I'm not sure how well you guys can see the difference, but it's a lot different in here. Yeah, it is a lot huh. different. <laughs> wow. Looks good, babe. Yeah, it does look good. It's gonna look really good. When everything's said and done, guys, and the house looks so amazing inside, because it's going to, <laughs> you could think this person right here, where's she at? There she is. No, over here. There she is. <laughs> you think this person right here. Because I've mentioned this before, but I just want to mention it again. So when Roxanne and myself decided on doing all of this, our biggest plan or our, our, not our plan, our agreement was that she designs the entire inside of the house and I'm responsible for the outside, except for the garden. Yeah, yeah. Except for the garden. Yeah. So like I said, when everything looks really good and you're like, man, that looks so good. Well, I give will her say credit. this, I have run my ideas by you just to make sure I didn't come up with anything, you know, super Well, crazy. she did want a neon pink wall and I said, no, nope, ain't gonna happen. Yeah, or nope. red. No, nope, ain't gonna happen. No, 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 no. No, we had a bright red bathroom once already in our lives. Ain't gonna happen again. Yeah. That's really hard to paint over. Yeah, I've come a long ways with my <laughs> painting colors um, over the years. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> so this looks really good in my opinion. Can you guys tell the difference now? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Roxanne's gonna be getting down on some paint. And I have another project that needs to get done. And then I'm gonna help her out finishing that paint. But now that we have the second, well, not the second, the last portion of the deck covered, kind of where our uh, chairs are at on the deck, underneath the living room window on the outside of the deck, or on the deck, I wanna install another uh, electrical outlet. And that's been the plan since the beginning, but I had to wait until everything was covered and stuff because I didn't want the water to go on the outlet. But now I can do it. So I'm gonna get that going so we can move that big uh, freezer that's inside the house, put that on the, out on the deck so when we're working in the house, we don't have so much stuff in our way. Because the entire time we've been inside that shed, like the entire time there's been so much stuff in the way. And yes, it's our fault, but we wanted to protect our stuff. So, but now I don't have to do that no more. I can move it out of the way and be done with it. these with a 20 amp plug should be pretty easy to install this is how I installed them on the outside um, already I got two over here on this side and I'm gonna be installing this one underneath that window right there so I'm gonna be using my tester again guys real quick just to make sure 
as you guys can see, to two lights, that means there's power there. So I'm gonna go flip the breaker off. And now you can see there's no more power. So make sure you guys flip the breakers off and turn the power off before you do anything with outlets or call an electrician if you're not comfortable with it. I do want to say the outlet outside is not a permanent outlet for a freezer. It's just to have another outlet out on the deck. Um, we barely have any amp draw on these outlets as it is now anyway. So moving the freezer from inside here to out here is going to be completely fine. Uh, for now, I know refrigerators and freezers should have their own dedicated outlets. Our refrigerator does, and that freezer is just going to be tied into the living room outlets for right now. And I think it should be completely fine. Flip the breaker back on, using this again. You should get, bottom you can't read it, but it says, correct wiring two white, uh, two lights on the right hand side. And there we go. Good to go. Decided to make some lunch for Roxanne and myself. And I don't know about you guys, but I really like hot dogs. I know they're probably not the best thing for you, but I absolutely love them. But the key is getting bun length hot dogs. But today we got to use regular bread because we ran out of hot dog buns, but that's okay. They still taste amazing. All right. Roxanne is all finished painting except for the accent wall. So she, she's got the one last color that she has picked out. And I think this color is gonna be really nice and she has other ideas to match this color in other places later on. Mm -hmm. So let's see what she's got, guys. <laughs> It's 
it's a green color, like a foresty olive kind of green. And I think with the green and like the off-white cream color on the walls and the flooring and what our ideas for the ceiling, I just think this is gonna really complete this room. Separate it a little bit. Yeah, I have something else that I'm gonna do to this accent wall, but for right now, I'm just going to paint it. And uh, I think it's gonna look great. I'm excited. <laughs> Wow. It's pretty green. Yeah. <laughs> this is called Farm Fresh, which I find very appropriate for this house. There it is, guys. <laughs> the accent wall. It's, uh, what was it, Farm Fresh? Farm Fresh, yeah. Farm Fresh. Yeah, I, I love the color. I think it looks really, really nice. Me too. And um, I think, like I mentioned earlier, there is something else I want to add to this wall, but it's going to have to wait. And, and like I said earlier, there, this color, it's going to be kind of a, not a whole theme in here, but it's going to be, it's accents, right? Yeah. Some little here's and yeah. there's. So we do have some plans um, later on to add this color back in somewhere else, like we said. Yeah. And I think it's a good color, babe. I think so too. I like it and it it's seems nice. to be changing a little bit as it's drying, which is great. Um, I like it. You have to do a second coat though. Yes, it definitely needs a second coat. I can see the little white smears behind there, so. But how exciting, guys. It is. I'm so happy. The paint's done in here, except for this wall. Yeah. I can get ready on the other stuff that needs to be done. We are like, that much closer guys i know it's exciting so nice good job baby god love it yeah <laughs> <laughs> but why it's gonna be home any minute guys um we just we're happy you're here to share this with us it's very exciting for us and i'm so happy yeah me too <laughs> me too you guys have a great day thanks for watching our video and we will catch you all on the next one bye bye